Well, first on the rundown tonight at 534, 27 years, his life was behind bars. Imagine that until the district attorney reviewed his case and got him exonerated of a murder that another man admitted to. Valentino Dixon is an artist and his ability has landed him opportunities as a free man that some only dream to have. Channel 2's Claudine Ewing sat down with him to talk about his trip to the Masters. How life changes. Last year, Valentino Dixon was a man with a number in prison, talking to us about why he should be free. This year, he's on the green and meeting Tiger Woods. While in prison for a murder that he was eventually exonerated of, Dixon was asked to draw a picture of Augusta National while in Attica. And this is the picture that got it started. This is the picture that I drew based on this. Okay which led to the Golf Digest uh, investigating the case. And drawing golf courses are now part of his signature. He calls this the granddaddy of them all, this picture of Augusta. And now that he's seen it in person. You can see things in person that you can't possibly see in a magazine or a photograph. And he plans to do it again. I believe I can capture that whole a lot more vivid a lot more detail than ever. He knows it was a privilege to be at the Masters. Well, I went as a Golf Digest illustrator. He will do future drawings of what he saw, but it's who he met. Target Woods, Jack Nicklaus, uh, Tom Watson gave me a lesson. Just like that. And before Tiger won, Dixon predicted it. I just felt it in my heart that, that he was going to win. He says Tiger knew his story. And it was just the greatest feeling in the world, especially from where I come from. And when Tiger won, Dixon was on the road to an Innocence Project conference. I got text that he won. While at the Innocence conference, he met with Amanda Knox, the woman who spent time in an Italian prison for murdering a fellow exchange student and then acquitted. Dixon is on a mission for prison and sentencing reform. Ultimately, my goal is to get before Congress and to speak to the president and say, hey, this is a human rights issue, not just civil rights violations against all people, and Valentino Dixon said the experience at the Masters was awesome and beyond belief. Augusta will always be a passion project. Other projects for him include making greeting cards. Some of them I have in my hand and some other big companies are also looking to work with him. You know, he does not seem bitter to me. He's no, not coming yeah. off as bitter. He's coming off as someone who really wants to change the system. It's now. interesting you say that because today when we were sitting down speaking with him in his home, I said, y you seem so humble. Right. And he said, where else, how else would I rather be than humble? I mean, think about it. Last year this time, we yeah. were making yeah. arrangements to go Visit see him, him in prison. Right. And now he's with millionaires. And he's doing a lot of good in this world. And he is. Yeah. And, you know, it's also about second chances. And, and that's one of the things he talked about. And that's why he wants to meet with Congress. 27 years behind bars. Yeah. Wow. All right. Thank you, Claudine.